What's up guys, we're back with another Beckett return video. So this is only the second time I've done a BGS return and this is from the Legend of Blue Eyes first edition box opening. You guys have not seen it yet when I'm recording this. So you guys will see this after that obviously and it's gonna be pretty awesome. Before that, the giveaway. I'm giving away these three cards. We got a Winged Dragon of Raw, a couple of old school cards. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, and give me a guess on the highest grade you think we're going to get in here or the lowest grade. So let's go ahead and hop into this and cut open this crazy box. This thing's hard to get into. All right, we have our seven cards. The problem with Beckett Returns is that they can be spoiled by the color of the label. So it's kind of interesting. We did one before and graded five cards. This time we graded seven, six from the LOB box, and then also one more, the Mystical Elf from the 20K special. So I sent all those in together. So let's see what we got. We're going to do it like this. Okay, I'm gonna try not to look at the label, but we have, I don't know what this is. Let's just flip it around, because I don't know what this is. Oh my goodness. Boo, BGS9, look at this. 9.5 on everything except centering. They gave an 8.5. Already disappointed in this return. So there's one of our ultras. It got not even a 9.5, a nine. So we have, I mean, the centering is not that good, but 8.5, that's pretty rough. I don't know. Might as well have sent it to PSA at that point, getting a just to get a nine at BGS, because those are pretty rough. No, people are not really big fans of BGS nines. Okay, and that includes me. I'm not a big fan, so that kind of stinks. But that's okay. We do have this in a ten anyway. Hopefully, the leg will at least get an at least get something for us. So, Gaia. I think we started at the back, so maybe we should uh, not start there so we can do the leg last. Next card. Uh, I. It's so hard not to look at these. Um, what is this? So our nods to look at the label. So I'm just gonna have to flip this around. I don't know what the deal is here. So here we go. Oh, we got we got another silver label. Oh my goodness, is this about to be just a complete annihilation right here? Eight point what? Surface eight point five. This is straight out of a pack. Eight point five surface. Are the what are the no? Those scratches are on the case. Eight, I just noticed this is an 8.5 overall. Oh my goodness. Wow. This is awful. Is that stuff? Oh, is that like a bunch of stuff on the back like PSA does? Ooh. 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 Right out of the pack in 8.5. I am not, not feeling too good about this. The next one, I, I'm expecting all nines are worse at this point. If that one was an 8.5. We have a silver label. 8.5? Are you kidding me? A Surface 8? Do they not know what glossy cards are? What's the deal here? Is there like a print line or something I'm missing? It's so hard to see because these, like these cases have these lines. I think there's a print line right there. Oh my goodness. This is terrible. Yeah, there's definitely a print line in there. But eight on the surface? I don't know about that. There's all this stuff in there. I hope that's on the sleeve. Please be on the sleeve. Wow, this is terrible. We're not going to get a single gold label out of this whole submission, are we? Whew. Wow. Oh, look, we got a nine because we got a nine surface. Oh, my. God. Who would have thought the Gaia would have been the best grade so far? Mystical Elf, nine. Ew. Ew. I'm not happy with this at all. I'm extremely disappointed in this. Wow, I should have just sent them to PSA because I spent I sent these in the five day service, which I will say was extremely fast. I was super happy with that. Paid a hundred dollars a card to get eight point fives and nines right out of the pack. Wow, that is brutal. Eight point man, they are just killing this. I mean this one centering is horrible, but you're telling me that these centering are the same? Wait, let me look at this. I guess they are They are pretty similar, I guess. They're both pretty bad, but man. Whew, this is brutal. I think we got all silver labels, that's what I'm guessing. Yes, yeah, so we're back to the guy. Guy is the best grade so far, which is good. It's the ultra, but... Whew. 
8.5 Mystical Elf. That 9 Mystical Elf was probably the one out of the 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 uh, blister pack, not the booster box. So, oh my. An 8 centering. An 8 centering. Oh my. We got 9.5 on everything else with an 8 centering. I mean, the centering is bad, but... Whew, this is disappointing. All right. Ah... <sighs> Nine with 8.5 centering, 9.5 everything else. Trap hole, fantastic. Just what we wanted to see. And finally, I can already tell because of the silver label on the back. Silver label. At least we got a nine this time. 8.5 centering. Okay, you're telling me this is 8.5 centering? That's insane. That's not that bad. I mean, the centering looks so much worse than the trap hole to me. All right, BGS people, defend your company because I am not feeling too good right now. All silver labels. We even got three 8.5s. We didn't even get nines out of the pack. We got 8.5s. So the surface and corners are 9.5s. Edges are a nine. Why are the edges a nine? You can't see in here because this daggum sleeve. Okay. I'm, I gotta look close. I, I don't see anything on the edges that makes this a 9. This is brutal. This is brutal. I am not happy about this. <sighs> Beckett. Thank you for the 9s. Okay, wait. Is this all 7? Yeah, so here's our... We got 9. We got 9. Okay, wait. Let me get the old, other Ultra. 9, 9, 9. 8.5. 9, 8.5, 8.5, oh my goodness, not gonna lie, I might never send a Beckett again after this, just because like, the whole reason to send in to Beckett for me is to get the possible 9.5 on off-center cards, and to get 8.5s and 9s on them, might as well just send in a PSA and get the 9, you know, like this is, this is rough, or even an 8, I'd rather have a PSA 8 than a BGS 8.5, like what is, who wants an 8.5, like for real? Oh, that hurts, so. I was hoping to be excited about one card, but I can't be happy about any of them. The good side is neither of the Ultras got an 8.5. They at least got a 9. So maybe they can cross to a PSA 9. I don't even know if it's worth it to send them for a PSA 9. Whew. That's pretty rough. I know it's my third BGS submission because I sent the Red Eyes. Now that I'm, I just remember that. Whew. I've never gotten a good LOB grade from BGS. We've always gotten nines or less, I'm, I think. And then the last sub, I've never gotten a 10 sub grade. Ever. These are pack fresh cards. I've never gotten a 10 sub grade. Seven of them. So was the Red Eyes. So was like three of the other cards I sent. Never gotten a 10 sub grade. Not corners, not edges, not centering. I mean, the centering, obviously, not on these. But So we got super unlucky on that LLB box. We got super unlucky on the grading. So this is just a very... I'm disappointed. I'm very disappointed. Just really sad, to be honest. Like, I don't even know. What do I even do with these? I, I don't want 8.5s. You know? So now my swords are revealing light. PSA gave me an 8 on my other one. So we have 8 and 8.5. So we got... Brutal grades, we're just super unlucky. Glossy cards are just awful. If you ever consider opening glossy box, don't based on this submission. But yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, hope you guys have better luck than I did. See you later. Peace. Oh! Elemental Hero, Dark Bright, boom!